game night. I'm your host, Chip Revisor, and today we're going to play some more Formula 1 2012 on the computer. In the last episode, I qualified 20th, giving me a tough job to get myself into the points. We are going to try anyway. Let's see how it goes. And we are starting pretty much in the back. Which isn't all that good. This is your first race, so concentrate on keeping it clean this and race? a good result should follow. Good luck. Listen up all the way down. So fucking early. There we go. Nine spots or so. Ah, uh, six spots. Or so. Come on, drive it. Fuck you. Five seconds ahead? God damn it. 
How am I ever going to be? That guy. Oh. Fuck. It looks like you've picked up some debris on the tires. You'll lose some grip until yes. it wears off. Come on. We estimate Force India will be bringing Hulkenberg in soon, within the next five laps. Within the next five laps. Thanks. And what do you base that estimate on? The car behind has some minor damage to his front wing. Doesn't look too serious. Thanks. What happens to my window? Mirrors. Shouldn't have your people through that? Thank you, fucking idiot. Okay, we lost that position. Put some pressure on him and try to get it back. Don't hit me from behind.
But I have 40 seconds. Plus. That seems to be good. And.
data showing that the car ahead is likely to be running in fuel conservation mode. His time will be slightly slower than normal. Thanks. Okay, times are looking good. You're matching race pace. I am matching race pace. And I'm three positions above my expected. It's also looking very good. And I can't fail to take the corner properly. Or this one. We need to keep up the pace. The gap to the car behind is four seconds. Alright, sir. You tell me to do things, I do things. That's how this works, right? Don't you dare overtake me. You are not going to overtake me. Kobayashi. You stay so nicely on that racing line. How do you do that? Oh wait, computer. This is Kobayashi. This game just looks very good. That's all I have to say about that. We can't afford to lose too much time stuck behind the car ahead. You're faster than him in sector two. Sector two. I am faster than him in sector two. Every other sector, I am much slower. The car ahead has some minor damage to his front wing. Doesn't look too serious. Yep, that's what I did to him. Haha, <laughs> fucking idiot.
Why did you crash? Oh, we yeah. asked. So much faster than I did. Your tires are at a good temperature. Thanks. Good temperature. 26 seconds. Fastest level 33 9? Come on. Ouch. You've picked up some marbles. Expect reduced grip until you can wear them off. Stay on the racing line. Stay on the racing line, Jeff. What are you doing? Don't go out into the world. Grip the marbles. That's not good for the tires. Can't be. A 10 second penalty dropped me down 3 spots, but I still managed to meet the developers' expectations. Next week we'll be racing on a beautiful track of Malaysia. To give you an impression of the track, 
Here's the official hot lap video by Anthony Davidson. Okay, here we are, Sepang, Malaysia, on the run-up towards the last corner. Open this corner up by taking a wide approach and maximizing the length of the straight and your speed onto it. DRS is open and a big curves boost as well, past the start-finish line, the pits on your right-hand side. Now eyes to the left, you want to look out for those marker boards, 100 meter board, break in a straight line and ease the car towards the apex, down from 180 miles an hour into second gear, 50 miles an hour for the turn two as well. Don't let the car snap on you too much on the exit of turn two itself and then wind the car around using DRS and a little curves boost as well up the hill towards turn four. 100 meter board, late braking into this one and don't use too much curb on the exit, that will really upset the balance of the car. Now towards turn five, 155 minimum speed between these two corners, left and then right, and watch that exit curb as well. Turn seven, down through the gears, two gears down, the double apex right-hander of seven and eight. Open up the car now towards the right-hand side to maximize the entry in towards turn nine, a left-hand hairpin that goes uphill on the exit. Keep the car nice and straight and watch the rear from getting away from you through turn 10. In towards turn 11, open this corner up as much as you can. It's an off-camber corner and it can sometimes catch out the rear of the car. Flat out now through turn 12 and flick the car right towards probably one of the hardest corners in the entire season of Formula One, turn 14. Don't miss the apex on the inside, that's the thing you're aiming for. And now a nice rest before the final corner. Bring the car to the right-hand side. Braking marker boards on the left-hand side. Don't lock up into this final corner. Very easy to do here as it's off camber again on the exit. Not too much curb on that final corner and the run down towards the start finish straight once more. DRS again and a final burst of curves. And that concludes our another episode of Game Night. Next Thursday we'll start off the next Grand Prix weekend at Malaysia. Until then, my name is Jeffrey Fischer and I thank you for watching this episode of Game Night. See ya!